100% record. Pressure from Gardner Hickman. And Zahor is loitering with considerable insight under Sam Allardyce. Ethan Ingram has been on the championship bench this season. Bell, and the flag stayed down, but it has crept out. Yeah, Bamiyan's positioning here, the timing of his forward run is excellent. Now, the problem is when you're a, a centre half. Tavares. Up against Ingram Hickman. Didn't even know he was going to start half an hour ago. And will be. I'm sure an important figure for them this season. Gardner Hickman. Kalasinac. Fellows. Takes aim with his weaker foot. And a bit of work for Ramsdale to do. Yeah, it's slightly difficult for the Arsenal goalkeeper because the ball is bouncing as it arrives. And Cedric Kipre. Not exactly an elder statesman himself. Yang. Might for his reach. Zahor in there. And Saka, he's found his way through and worked for Palmer, but it's put in by Aubameyang. And Arsenal at last this season have a goal. Something to lift the mood for Mikel Arteta, something much needed. Well, West Brom had been the most threatening team you know, up to this point, but it able to work the space to get the shot away. Any player up with him at the moment, although Odegaard is arriving. It's opened up invitingly. And Odegaard is there. With the angle too tight. Pepe. There. And so too is Ethan Ingram. There's a horse trying to spin away and taken out, but the referee foot down on the gas. Oh, it's about elected. Out to Tavares. Oh. That's it in a nutshell, really. He's made strides again. No flag, but Palmer is out. And, well, Kipre has borne the brunt of it. Yeah, he seems to get caught. Jaka. Pepe the target for Chambers. Pepe in space. Pepe offside. Combination of physicality and technical ability. <laughs> he knew. Snodgrass will take it on. Comes out to Tavares in space. Set. Pepe's away. Oh, and Arsenal are away in the end through Aubameyang. Closing in on half-time, Arsenal sees total control. I mentioned it a couple of times throughout this half, a really high defensive line that West Brom are holding and the, the problem when the ball is played in. But Saka finds Aubameyang, who's in for the hat-trick. Palmer to deny him, but they can't deny Pepe. They're running away with it now. Suddenly the mood is just that little bit brighter. And again, Arsenal get in behind. And I'm sure Aubameyang, with the overhead kick, he's trying to score here. I think he just doesn't catch it. He's shone through. There hasn't been a humbling of a Premier League side so far in this round. Finals. Tavares making progress. Saul Shotten clipped in by Xhaka. Odegaard, that's beautifully done. And Saka! With swagger and style, they diminish any lingering doubts. Bukayo Saka on the end of a beautifully constructed move. Yeah, it's simple, really effective football. Pass and move football. Here's Reach. Poor oh, chance for Fellows. And it may yet break for Sahor. And Ramsdale with the, his most. Snodgrass to Gardner Hickman. It's broken kindly for him. Well, there were other. 
Erdogan foot down on the gas. Taylor, Taylor dealing with it. Aubameyang, Patrick Hunt. Shot him. Zahor dueling. Earls. What a chance on here. Oh! Absolutely glorious. Well, that's some way to seal a hat trick. Artistry from Pierre Enric Aubameyang. Now, as soon as the ball was given away, you knew that West Brom were in trouble because Arsenal were swarming forward. And again, he just makes the right decision. Might reach Aubameyang. It. And he hasn't quite found the finish. Well, what a shame. I'll talk about getting to the pace of the game as a substitute. A leaner than they would like here at the Hawthorns. Well, it's Tino! Oh! Well, there is the impact that Alexander Lacazette was looking for. Well, he certainly got up to speed quickly enough. Six for Arsenal. That is how. Oh, and Ramsdale there at the second time of asking. Saka. Well, it's escaped to Vares, who went to Guerres. Dancing to his tune. Oh, and he's able to pick it up like a set. 